So it has been nine months since we have last played The Sims. And listen, I did that on purpose, okay? You know how when a series comes out, all the episodes come out, and then usually there's like a gap until the finale comes out to build suspense? That's exactly what happened. Today is the finale of The Sim series. It's the finale. And I really wanted to build some suspense. That's basically, that's what I was doing. Building some suspense. And I mean, it worked. Are you guys, are you guys suspended right now or what? So yeah, this is the end of the series, which is very sad. It's, it's sad, but it's more bittersweet because we're gonna be starting a new Sim series after this one. I do have to say though, I'm a little bit nervous to load into my game because it has been such a long time. I don't really know what state my Sims are in. All I can really remember is that we locked Santa in a vault and we're tr we were trying to kill him. Oh my God. It really has been a long time, you guys. Look at this. Unsupervised Sims? Oops, you better check out what they've been up to. Oh my God, they're actually calling me out. All right, we're back and wow, after nine months, it looks like, looks like Santa is still stuck in the vault. Oh my God, I actually kind of feel bad. What are all these? Uh-oh. Oh God, he's really panicking, huh? Wait. <gasps> I'm old. I'm old. Oh my God. My ass is still fat though. Wait, I'm not gonna lie. Like it's actually still fat and it's lifted. Like for being old, like it's lifted. But oh my, I'm old. I'm old. What happened? What? And I have a camel toe too. Ned, he's all, <gasps> my children, they're grown. Is this limey? Lemony? <gasps> I miss, I'm, I missed out on my children's childhood. Wait, I'm kind of a milf though. I'm not gonna lie about it. Like I'm built differently for a grandma. Someone in the chat says me think guilt. That's so true, you guys. I'm not even a milf anymore. I'm straight up a gilf. Like I'm elderly. I'm just a little bit worried that people may have forgotten about me. I mean, it's been so long, I've aged, I look a little different now. And I, I haven't finished my world famous celebrity aspiration. I still need to get three autographs and receive 25 positive responses from inciting cheers. Although I've got two so far. So I actually think, I actually think we can do this. And I think this is an urgent matter, you guys. I don't know how much time I have left. I fear my future is looking like Judith's. Flappy, Ebso, Arza. Flappy, Flappy! Yikes. <laughs> nah. I wouldn't want to beat him. It's okay. I'm old, I'm old, but I'm sexy. I'm old, but I'm... What is Ned doing? What is wrong with this man? He's just playing in trash? <gasps> Wait, guys, it's Judith. It's Judith, she's back from the dead. I need to see her now that I'm old. We have to hold hands. Oh God. Wait, this is a romantic action and... <sighs> get out of here, Ned. You're gonna ruin this moment. I need to put Ned, like maybe he can go to sleep or something. Get out of here. Me and Judith need to have our like elderly moment together. Oh, it happened too fast. It happened too fast and we missed it. And now Ned has a new personality trait, jealous. Kato was cheated on by someone he cared for and is in a jealous rage. Oh, come on, Ned. We didn't even, we didn't even cheat. We just, we just held hands. What's going on up here? What's going, I told you to get downstairs and get in bed. We're trying to have a moment here. Stop, go downstairs, get in bed now. Turn off this whack music. How did this affect our relationship? Okay, we're still good. We're still good though. Yeah, it's not a big deal. Yeah, no big deal. Betrayed by cheating. No big deal though, that will go away. Judith, oh my God, I'm old now. I'm old now, just like you. What do I do? Can I ask for like advice? Let's have a deep conversation about this, Judith. What do I do? I'm old, I'm wrinkly. 
My boobs are sagging. Let's see how the children grew up. We've kind of been neglecting them. I mean, it's been nine months and now they've gone from toddlers to children. Like, how did they grow up? Let's, let's see. Oh, erratic. These Sims can talk to themselves and have unpredictable emotions. Oh, okay, well, that's just Lemony. Uh, I'm sure Limey is not though. Erratic, okay. Uh, what's this? Talk to self. <laughs> Limey literally wants to talk to herself. Like that's like a want she has right now. What else? Be funny with Santa. Okay. All right. Well, I guess the kids didn't really um grow up that great. But oh, let's be real, you guys. Like they are in the spotlight. They're like celebrity children. Are they famous? No. Oh, they kind of haven't. <laughs> How do they have like a negative reputation? What do they even do? I don't know. I think this might be, this just might be a consequence of growing up under the spotlight, you know? <laughs> yeah. Everyone in the chat saying, Jen, the kids need beds, the kids need beds. Guys, I'm pretty sure they're fine, okay? If they wanna sleep somewhere, look at this. There's two benches right up here and there's a couch here. They're fine. And Le Le Lemony is just having fun with the toilet. Wait, what the f*** went happened up here? Everything's breaking. Oh damn, I forgot that I have a gig, you guys. Oh god, I didn't even think about that. Do you think they even... Do you think they even still want me to do it now that I'm old? I'm pretty sure I booked this gig as a, an adult and now I'm elder. Get in an angry emotion and then perform mean interactions. We have to like bully someone to get into an angry emotion. Maybe we should bully our husband. All right, let's get him, guys. Argument. Ask what Kato's problem is. Let's do that. Yeah. Huh. I'm Vitash, huh? <laughs> Who's singing right now? Do you guys hear that? I turn this off. Maybe it's the music. Grenoble. Oh. Ooh. New family dynamic difficult. I mean. I think we kind of do have a difficult family dynamic right now. He did just catch me holding hands with Judith and I don't know, I was yelling at him. Mean, go away. Uh. Go away. Uh. Oh, he's angry now. Oh, he's very angry. Wait, I need him to calm down. He might die. <laughs> go calm down. Calm yourself down. Get out of that nasty, vile mood that you're in for no reason. I'm just gonna start shouting forbidden words Ew. until I get really angry. Ugh, Pelnoy. Ugh, for no. Ugh, Pelnoy. Okay, we've got some angry moodlets, but it's not angry enough. There's too many good things going on. Oh my God, I'm just way too confident to be mad right now. Should I start bullying one of the children? Let's punish her like strictly. Argue about house rules. Mother of the year right here, y'all. Lemony, I have to do this. It's for my role. I'm a method actor. I'm a method actor, okay? So don't take it personally. I'm method acting, okay? Damn, how long is this gonna last? This argument that we're having right now. I'm really getting into my role. What's this? Oh, Limey's asking for some advice right now. I got a present that I think is dumb. I want to trade it with a friend or give it back. Can I do that? Yeah, give it to someone else. Oh. God, my gig is coming up, you guys. I'm still not angry enough. If only my confidence was a little lower. It's like, I'm just so confident I can't get in an angry mood. Oh, we just got a royalty report, you guys. Let's check it out. Uh, I verbally attacked my biggest fan, made $86. I locked someone in my safe. Just kidding though, made 142. What happened to Vanessa? True crime, $270. I'm pregnant father reveal, 376. That was a heavy hitter on the internet. That one did really well. My side of the story, my career is being sabotaged by a ghost, not monetized, but secret is it was monetized because I made $492 off of it. So um, that seems like it was the biggest hit. I think more people might've clicked on it because it wasn't monetized. So that was a good title there. It looks like I might have to bully my husband again because I do feel a little bit bad about bullying the kids. They're already erratic as it is. So I think I need to get into another argument with him. What's this on the floor? It's the dirty diaper. 
<laughs> There's a dirty diaper on the floor still. They're fully children right now. <laughs> There's still a dirty diaper on the floor. Kina, Wanu, Smart Anita. Pando, Chris Quar. How do I get angry? Huh, Kofa? Huh? Have Ned yell at you, maybe? Okay, that's a good idea. Let's have him yell at her. Talk through issues? No, that's not gonna make me mad. We got to malicious insult. Let's do that. Sawata, Bima, Seneca, Belinda, Grinia. Oh, what the f? You have 24 hours to pay your bills before your water is shut off? We have a million dollars in the bank and no one paid the bills. Right, I'll make Ned do that after he yells at me. <laughs> Yell at her. <laughs> Ned's about to shit himself. I'm not letting him use the bathroom until he argues. Why are they flirting? No, 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 no. Mean, malicious insult. All right, come on. My God, this method acting is tearing our family apart, but it's not working even. What are the kids doing? Kids are hard at work doing sit-ups right now for whatever reason. Damn it, we didn't get angry in time. This is so frustrating. Okay, I'm really nervous. I'm not as hot as I used to be when I was younger, so I just hope they still want me on set. Okay, I just had to stunt. Hey guys, it's me. Okay, you know what? While I'm here, let's incite some some cheers right now. We got a lot of people watching and I'm sure these guys are all fans of me since, you know, they're working on my movie set. Come on, guys. Get the mouse charm. Woo! Not a single cheer? What the hell? There must be some kind of mistake. Uh, maybe... What? Am I really old news? Wait, let me let me try that again. Let me try that again. Because I okay, I know I'm older now, but it's still me. I feel like I've reached like icon status. I mean, I'm super famous. It's me, Jen McAllister. Let me try one more time. Get <laughs> What the hell, you guys? Wait, what is my reputation? I thought it was good. Pristine reputation, global superstar. What the f I'm a flop. I'm a flop. Girl, just cut this out. Stop embarrassing yourself. All right, let's just get to work, I guess. Do you think they know that I yelled at my husband and kids? Maybe like a news outlet picked up on the story or something. Oh, Octavia's calling. Hey, listen, we need a place to stay for a little while. You can accommodate us, right? It'll be like we're not even here, I promise. Octavia, what? Oh, Octavia. I thought you guys had a big mansion. Do you guys think they got evicted or something? Maybe Octavia's in her flop era too, I don't know. All right, I'll, I'll lend a helping hand to our old fan. Uh, I'll lend a helping hand. <laughs> I'll lend a helping hand to our old friend Octavia. Do me up real nice. Let's see what they do. <laughs> do you think they're gonna change my hair from being gray or do you think just the style? Oh, beautiful makeup. Time for the hair. Oh, oh my <laughs> God, I knew it. I knew it. They're pissed. They're pissed that I'm old now. And you know what? Quite frankly, this is ageist. I'll say it. This is ageist. It doesn't matter how old I am. I'm still a great person. I'm still super famous. Come on. Go get your clothing on now. Let's see. They'll probably put me in a slutty outfit now, too. I knew it. Look at that. 
Look at that cleavage they got me in. Guys, I'm pushing 85. You don't need to have my yitties hanging out. It is what it is, I guess. At least, you know, at least I still got the gig. So let's get to work. We got to post on our Simstagram story. Um, how to Simstagram story. Warba Taranga. <laughs> and let's practice our acting. Oh my God, I gained 1,800 followers from that. That's crazy. All right, let's compliment a Sim on set. I'm not gonna be complimenting this guy who put me in this slutty outfit and changed my gray hair to brown. But why don't we compliment, let's compliment her. Let's sign an autograph too while we're at it. I mean, it is something I have to do down here. Sign three autographs. So let's, yeah, let's sign a little autograph. Papa. I feel like she's gonna want one, you know? Here you go. Jimbo Bange. <laughs> Zimze? What? What is going on? She rejected my autograph. Guys, what is going on? Let me check this again. Global superstar, pristine reputation. What else does it take to hand out an autograph? I just don't. <sighs> Be nice to that, Sim. Let me go compliment this one instead. Oh, it still worked though. I still signed an autograph, even though she rejected it. So joke's on you, Rin. Joke's on you, Rin. All right, let's go compliment this PA. We've been working together for forever, so. Oh, actually, this is the producer. I love you, girl. All right, and I think we're ready to go, you guys. Listen to fan. Oh, I've got a fan coming up to me. Yes. Okay, okay. Maybe I can give an autograph to this fan. Who's my fan that I'm supposed to listen to? Oh, where'd my fan go? All right, well, let's just let's just do our gig and get out of here. I'm ready to perform. <laughs> it was a delusion. <laughs> You're hallucinating. I feel like it might have been. At least at the end of the day, we are a very professional and talented actress. So much so we can do the risky ones. You know, we're gonna go all out here, so. Get ready for these performances, guys. They're gonna blow your hat off. <laughs> Oh, That's right. I ended her. I ended her. And you know what? She deserved it. I know it's just acting, but she did reject me earlier, so it was time for her to get ended. All right, risky fight. I'm about to beat this bitch up now. I know this is just acting, but there's a bit of method acting to this one. So check this out. Horrible. Yeah, that's right. Whoa, whoa, you in too. She doesn't even know where to look. That's right. Don't get it twisted. Perform the guitar scene. No, I think we have pretty good guitar skill if I remember correctly. Let's see. Yep, guitar six. So I'm gonna go all out here and and risk it all. Risk it for the biscuit. Yee-haw! Yee-yee! Granny still got it. And Granny's funny too. Check out this joke <laughs> I'm about to lay down on the stage here. Here we go. Bamboofa and Bamboofa. Bamboofa. Zolly Bongo. Zolly Boof Larga Oofa. Wiffler, yes, ah, uh, <laughs> Oh my god, I can't believe she just said that. All right, perform shouting scene. This might be the last scene. We're gonna risk it. Looks like I'm gonna yell at this alien. Take my sweet ass time to get over here. Okay, here we go, you guys. Harshavu, Yoba Yumpy Nargi, Wamba Boy. That's right. True. <laughs> and stay out. Oh, we have one more scene. Lockup scene. Oh, it's really going down for this one. Ooh. Wait, I think my back just went out for a second. <laughs> oh, Get in there and never come out. John Keenan. Barbo, Barbo. Yep. I killed that. Let me hear y'all make some noise for that performance I just gave. Woo! 
on B law. Ha <laughs> ha. Yibs. Woo. Puepa guas. Woo. Bob. Hell yes. Oh. Oh my God. Money earned nineteen thousand. All right. Normally I would go home after a gig after just slaying so hard, but I'm actually gonna stay here. What up? I need a little ego boost, you know? I've been inciting cheers. Oh, actually I got one. Look, three out of 25. I've been inciting cheers and it hasn't been really working out for me. So I'm gonna go out on the town. It's 7 p.m. I know the hip kids are gonna be out partying. I'm gonna incite some cheers out there. Maybe I'll go out in my bathing suit. I think if I'm like out like half naked like this, people might like really start cheering. Perfect. All right, let's go somewhere. I think we should go to the hottest spot in town, Studio P, B, P, baby. I used to go here all the time in my youth. All right, we are here. Where is everyone? Maybe they're already inside. Let's get in there. <gasps> Look who it is, you guys. Would you look who it is? It's Thorn. Where is everyone? It's Tuesday night, 7 p.m. I know it's a Tuesday, but we're in Hollywood, baby. We don't turn down for f***ing anything. Come on. All right, well, I can incite cheers at least for these three people. Thorn's gonna cheer for me. Oh, wait, he's inciting cheers right now. We are both Delulu. We're literally delusional. Thorn, you didn't even cheer for me. Hold on, I think he's just not seeing it. He's just not seeing it. Let me get over here. Let me go right in front of him and incite cheers again. Stop playing that right now. I'm literally about to debug him so he stops playing and he pays attention to my um, my cheers. Come on, Thorn. Give me a little, just one little cheer, please, Thorn. Let's go, Thorin. I knew I could count on you to hype me up. Wait. What? He's not- wait, he's not even! He's just inciting for his own cheers! Oh, here's a good crowd, you guys. Oh, these people will definitely cheer for me. Okay, wait, she's a little excited. Come on, guys! It's me, Jen McAllister! Oh, we got one. Sharnu Shabni. Shabni. Okay, we could sign some autographs. We could sign some autographs. Let's sign this one. Let's sign this one. Come on, guys. I don't have my yiddies and my fat ass hanging out for nothing. Cheer a little. Oh, look at this. Look at that. We got a lovely fan who wants an autograph. What about this one? Yes, another lovely fan who like an autograph. Hell yes, you guys. We got three autographs down. Now we just gotta get... Oh, look, we got another cheer too. Five out of 25. Okay, we can do this. We're almost done. We've got five out of 25 cheers. We only need 20 more. Here, I'll get a couple more right now. Check this out. Insight cheers. Yes, it's me. Oh no, you guys. I forgot to put on my adult diaper. All right, the party doesn't stop, you guys. It's only 11.30 p.m. Let's head to our next location. I know Granny's getting tired, but she's got to get some cheers. Let's go here. This is up-and-coming hotspot. This is probably where all the young kids are going, and that's definitely my demographic. All right. Right outside, I see two fans right here. Whippa, guas! Woo! Bob and F! Ho, ho! Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yep, it's me. <gasps> okay. 14 out of 25. <laughs> woo, woo! Woo, <laughs> woo! So I'm gonna throw $1,000 at everyone. And I'm gonna incite more cheers. And these guys are definitely gonna cheer after they get $1,000 from me. Yep. Come on, pick it up, you guys. Hell, they're not even cheering now. They just literally robbed me. Maybe it takes a little bit more money. <laughs> The person in the chat who just said this is insane behavior. I'm actually dying. Like, I'm literally an elder in a bathing suit. In the winter, by the way, like Christmas is tomorrow in the game. And I'm throwing money around and making people cheer for me. Come on, guys. All right, I think it's time for this granny to get home. Honestly, I got all the cheers I could. Y'all just robbed me of $2,000, but whatever. Oh God, I forgot about this. Look who showed up at the front door here. 
Octavia, Thorn, and Orange. Wow. After all the history we have together, here they are. Come and crawl into my front door with their suitcases. They want a place to stay. Wow. I wonder what's going on at home for them. I have a feeling they may have gotten evicted or something. It's a little sad. Oh wait, no one paid the bills? The family's been inside like in the dark this whole time? I told Ned to pay the bills. Can't have our guests seeing the lack of electricity. Oh, the lights turned on just in time. Okay, well, make yourself at home, I guess, you guys. They've been waiting all night. <laughs> That's so true. They asked me while I was at my my gig if they could stay with me and they've probably just been standing outside since like 12 p.m. And now it's 2 in the morning. I'm finally home. All right. Well, if you guys are going to stay with me, maybe you could at least help out around the house or something. Help out around the house, you guys. You can stay here. You just got to help out a little, okay? All right. Well, have fun, you guys. I'm going to go get some rest down here. My pod. Lemony likes fitness, okay. Yeah, sure. Oh, Finny has to pee. My sweet Finny, Lenny, Renny. Let's take him on a walk. What's going on out here? No one's supervising the child. Limey's swimming outside at three in the morning, okay. Yeah, I don't care that's 4 a.m. Go on a long walk. Finn deserves it, you know? Finn deserves it. Get out there. How's Santa doing? Now, how is Santa's hunger so high? Like. I don't understand. He's been locked in this safe now for a few days. I think he might be eating his own shit and drinking his own piss. Oh, that's true. Someone in the chat said he's eating the money. He might be doing that. Pretty sure we started off with 10,000 in here and now there's only 7,000. Oh, I'm glad someone's taking care of Finny Lin. Santa's thinking about an urn. Do you think he thinks he's gonna die? Oh God, you guys. I didn't even think about the fact that Octavia and thorn and orange are all here and we have santa downstairs trapped in the vault i really hope they don't figure out that he's in there it could be really bad for our reputation wait it's winter fest oh my god wait what is santa gonna do he's trapped in here is he gonna is he gonna use the magic of christmas to escape we literally have him held hostage. Wait, this is actually crazy. I have no idea how this is gonna play out right now. All I know is we're gonna put up some beautiful decorations for Christmas. Wow, how gorgeous. It's about time to wake up and get some breakfast. Grab a serving, what am I eating? Leftover wedding cake? We got married like 40 years ago. Let's uh put some presents under the tree and let's add some lights and stuff. Decorate with ornaments. Let's do red and gold. And let's do it with the children. That'll be a cute bonding activity. You know, it's Christmas day. The spirits are high. I'm not gonna be involved though. I've gotta feed myself something. Oh, look how sweet this is. Look at Thorn and Octavia. <gasps> Octavia's pregnant? Oh no. You guys, I don't know how to feel about this. You guys remember from back in my youth, I had a relationship with Octavia and Thorn, both of them. That's history, but now they're pregnant? And they asked to stay at my house? Oh my, should we kick them out, you guys? This is just kind of, this is just disrespectful. And I am pretty sure, don't you guys have a mansion to live at? Here it is, isn't this your house? Visit the Bailey Moon household. What is going on, you guys? You have a huge, big mansion, and you want to come over here, stay in my big, huge mansion, and rub it in my face? That you're pregnant? And for how long are you staying here? <gasps> One, two, three, four, five days? No, you guys, that baby is coming out while they're here. This is just f***ed up. And she did it at my Christmas party. Enough of this dancing, you guys. I don't want Octavia to move too much. She might burst. Let's do a little family um, present opening ceremony, especially because, you know, at the end of the day, it is my fault that Santa's not gonna show up, so. Ned's like shitting and pissing. He's like about to shit all over the floor. Ned, just open the presents really quick, then you can go to the bathroom, okay? Oh. Oh no, he... He didn't. Oh, come on. How are you gonna be standing right in front of the toilet and then pee yourself there? Hurry, get yourself in the shower before the kids see. Oh, no. 
She's right there. Go somewhere else. Daddy needs the bathroom. Go away. Oh my god, this is so humiliating. Thorn, Thorn, get out of here, please, Thorn. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. It's good to hear your voice, Jen. I wanted to ask you if I should get to know Dustin Broke a little better. I go for it. I don't know who that is. I don't associate with anyone with the last name Broke. I'm getting a little hungry though. Maybe I will step up for my family today and cook a grand meal since it's Christmas. Let's have our grand ham dinner. All right, mommy's really <laughs> stepping up. Wait, what just happened? I think I had a glitch. Okay, you guys, it is time for our great Christmas dinner. We're eating a little early, like it's Thanksgiving, 3.30 p.m. Called to grand meal, everyone. Carzini, kiss annoy. Come on, let's sit at the dining room table. No, sit at the dining room table. Guys, this is a, supposed to be our, our important, fancy meal. Come on. I'm gonna sit over here. How nice is this, you guys? We're actually having a beautiful family moment for once. This is just amazing. Meanwhile. Yikes. Santa is starving down here in the safe. Look at us. Look at us up here. Having a beautiful moment, and then he's down here. Wait, what? What is he doing? What is he doing? Is he making toys, maybe? <gasps> what? He broke out. He broke out of the safe. This is so bad. And he did it at my Christmas dinner. Guys, this is really bad. This is really bad because we have guests over and now they're gonna know that Santa was locked in the safe down there. What else do you think they're gonna think? Wait. <laughs> what? What's going on my front porch? Oh God, he's going upstairs right now, huh? Oh God, what is he gonna do? <gasps> oh no. In front of Octavia, he's yelling at me? Bueno. <laughs> Yeah, get out of there, girl. Seriously, get out of there. Don't let him talk to you like that, for real. He's really not doing too well. He's gonna go sleep in my bed? Oh, God. <gasps> Lemony can smell him from a mile away. Okay, Thorne's helping out around the house. Look at this stack of dirty dishes he's cleaning up after Christmas dinner. Okay, I like that, Thorne. Thank you. Guys, I'm actually scared of Santa. Like, why is he just standing there? Oh God, he's really mad, you guys, I'm scared. Oh, who's that? Who is that? Imposter! Who is that? Jeremy Zamora? That's not Santa, he doesn't even look like Santa. Guys, there's an intruder in the house. Beat him up, beat him up. This is why we need security. Seriously, how did this imposter get in my house? You're not Santa. I know you're not Santa. Yeah, and stay out. Get the f out of my house with those shoes. Seriously, get out of my house with those shoes. I'm scared. What is Santa plotting? Octavia upstairs fighting demons. She wants her baby to come out so badly. What's going on down here? Oh my god, you guys. Oh my god, I'm freaking out. Look how mad he is. And for what? I don't mean to defend Ned, but he didn't do anything. It was it was me. It was Jen. No, what's this? A present? Well, I guess it is Winterfest, you guys. And Santa has a gift for Ned? That's weird. I feel like they were just screaming at each other. Oh. Okay. Yes. Nobi. Oh. What was it? Ooh, 
the death flower? Oh my god! Santa? Santa, what did you just do? Santa, what did you just do? The death flower? Oh my god, I'm sick. I'm sick. He's very happy. Wow, okay. Really? Um, okay, that's a bit of an odd reaction from our daughter Limey over the death of our husband and our father. Okay, and that's even odder of a reaction from Santa here, who is legitimately the one who killed him. But me, on the other hand, girl, get up. Girl, get up. Grim's coming. <gasps> Grimmy. Hello. Wait, Vanessa? What is she doing here? Host with the most. Oh, yeah, what a great party we just had. My fucking husband died. Vanessa's shocked like she's not already dead. Wait, why am I very playful? Notched up. You guys, he's so mad for what we did to him. Wait, the fact that there's like music playing in the background. Oh my god, I'm feeling paranoid. <gasps> oh my god, here he comes, you guys! Oh my god, he's- Oh my god! <gasps> what? Don't open it! Don't open it! Ribix. <laughs> What was it? Was it just a normal gift? So you got a guitar. Oh, okay. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I was nervous. I thought he was about to kill me. Oh god, how are the kids doing? This is so sad. Seriously, this is so sad. How's Limey holding up? Oh god. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. I thought Santa fell asleep. I, th I thought Santa- Santa, wait! Santa, wait! Conga lawyer. Oh. Wait, wait, wait! Receive- Santa! Wait, 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 no, no! Uh, don't op- don't open it! Don't open it! Oh. Mel boy. Jen is dying from the gift of a death flower? Oh. Oh. Santa f Oh my god, he killed both of us! He killed- What is going on in the background over here? Like, Vanessa's having her own little show. Santa, you are an evil, evil man. And you're gonna go get in my pod. And you're gonna get in my pod. Listen, I know we locked him in the vault, but... It was just for like a week. Look how happy Vanessa is. I don't know if you noticed before, but Vanessa was blue, literally blue. And I just died and now she's green. She straight up went from sad to happy. She's like joyous over my death here. No, there is no way. There is no way that everyone's crying and she's cheering. Serious note, I've actually never seen that. A sim cheers when someone they hate dies. That is so f***ed up, Vanessa. I knew you were a snake. And that's why we killed you in the first place, okay? She's f***ing laughing and cheering. She's laughing and cheering. Right in front of my children, too. And that's rich coming from you, Santa. These tears. That's rich coming from you. When you just poisoned me and my husband, and you left our children as orphans.
<laughs> I'm dead at the cheerful music when that just happened. Are you f***ing serious? <laughs> the music! Game over! Oh no, Jen is dead and there are no more adult Sims alive. Sims Social Services will take it from here to take care for the children. Adoption Services will take care of Finn and find a good- No! No! Finn? Finn? Listen, I'm really sad that my children are going to Sim Social Services, but I'm really, really devastated that Adoption Services are taking Finn. That is actually the most devastating part of this ending. Seriously, this is f***ed up. Santa literally just went crazy on Christmas. Crazy on Christmas. What do I do now? Just save and... It's over. Wow. I mean, I guess you can only murder so many people until one of them murders you back. Guys, it is truly the end of an era. It's the end of an era. That was the finale of the Get Famous Sim series. I mean, I got famous and I made about a million dollars. But it looks like my skeletons in the closet came back to haunt me. And by skeletons in the closet, I mean Santa in the vault. In all seriousness, I really hope you enjoyed this Sim series because this has been going on for a really, really long time. It was so much fun. Honestly, this is very bittersweet. I'm gonna miss this series, but with the end of this series comes with the start of a new Sim series. Yes, we're gonna be starting a new Sim series here on my stream. I'm so excited. And who knows what we're gonna get into next time? Seriously, who knows? I. It could really be anything. So tune in to find out. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye YouTube.